Hi everyone, Crystal is Les here. I'm coming on today to share with you guys a little more about my interstitial lung disease that I have and um, dealing with getting a transplant and all that. Just giving you guys a little update on that. Okay, um, uh, like as you, as you guys know, I do rehab and I go you know, twice a week to rehab, but I go and I come back home. And um, what I'll be doing for the next four weeks, I'll be doing a program there where I have to stay in. So I won't be going and coming home, no. I'll be staying there for four weeks and um, doing a program with them because, like I told you, I've been going to the doctors a lot for this month for March. And um, my last appointment that I went, the doctor weighed me and I gained weight. Yeah. That's not good because I have to lose weight to um, help with my surgery for the transplant because when your body mass is too high, they can do the surgery, but the recovery process after the surgery is not as good if you have a lot of body fat. Um, so they want you to be a certain weight before they do the surgery. And um, I have lost a lot of weight, but in the past few months I put on some weight which is not good so now they're going to have me <clears throat> do a program like I said in the rehab facility where I stay in there for four weeks and they will help me with more exercise and have me on a diet plan to lose some weight while I'm there and in the meantime they'll be teaching me how to eat um, the portion portion size and what and what I shouldn't eat and what I should eat and, um, yeah, so I'll be learning all that while I'm there and losing some weight at the same time, which is good. And then learning how I should be eating because I, I know they talk about portion size and I thought I was doing okay, but obviously I wasn't. So, um, <clears throat> when I'm around it every day now for my three meals a day and they'll be showing me so I'll, I'll get to know what portion size that I should be eating and stuff like that and things that I should be eating and not eating yeah so oh, I'll be doing the four week program there which oh, I'm excited and nervous at the same time about that but um, I'll be getting it done and I was supposed to start Tuesday the 15th but they called me and said I have to come in the 16th instead, so just one day difference. So instead of going Tuesday, I'll be going in Wednesday. So, um, yeah. <laughs> I'll be doing that. Um, what else? Uh, I'll still be watching videos and stuff there because they said they have free Wi-Fi. They are free internet, so uh, you could bring your tablet, use your phone, bring your laptop, whatever you want to bring. So I have a laptop, I'll be bringing that, plus I have my phone, but I'll use my laptop more, so I'll still be watching videos <laughs> and stuff like that. And Oh, we get to come home on the weekends, I forgot to mention that. Um, we get to come home Friday evening, because Friday after we do the program, then we get to come home in the evening and then come back. We go back to the program Sunday. We could either go Sunday morning, Sunday afternoon, but we have to go back Sunday. So we do get to leave for the weekend. Yeah. So, um, yeah, so I guess I'll do my videos when I come home on the weekend. <laughs> and, um, yeah, so I just wanted to share that with you guys. Hope I didn't leave out anything. I don't think so. <clears throat> yeah, well, like I said, I'm looking forward to that to help me um, to lose weight for my surgery because I need it. Hopefully I will. Hopefully I will. Wish me luck. <laughs> Wish me luck. Anyways, I just wanted to share that with you guys. And thank you. And remember, as always, stay blessed from Petal is blessed. <laughs> Bye, everyone.